Salmon for the first. Stack deck favourite 250 from box seven. And they're moving in pretty well. Race one, Peninsula Dry Cleaners. Almost set to go for the first John. Stack deck the favourite around $2.50 on the tote. Made over the 5.20 metres and the green light on. Set to go for the first. Ready. Racing. Missing the start badly was uh, Fitzy's girl. Missed it by about 10 lengths and showing pace was the reserve. Bob and McGee to lead. Going up to second there, Flagstar Flyer. Round the outside was Stack Deck, the favourite, the rails captain, Bond. About eight lengths away then came Ain Vey. Well out of it there was uh, Fitzy's girl with Miff Starrin at the tail of the field. Was Sundu Will off the back straight. Reserve Bomber McGee, just the leader. On the outside, Flagstar Flyer. And joining in the centre was the favourite, Stack Deck. Flagstar Flyer went to the lead about a length and Flagstar Flyer won it. A length and a quarter to Stack Deck. Third was uh, Bomber McGee. A good gap in the field to Captain Bond. Then on the outside was Miff Star. Sundu Will, well out of it was Fitzy's Girl and Ain Vey and the race time there at 31.28. Number three, Flagstaff Flyer. Number three will be first. Stat deck number seven should get second. Number nine, Bomber McGee will be third. Three, seven, nine. Three, seven, nine. One is officially fourth. Number one, Captain Bond. Three, seven, nine and one. Three, seven, nine, one on the uh, opening race. A length and a half by neck. One and a half by neck on the first event. A length and a half by neck. 22.11. 22.11 off the back. 31.28. 31.28 the time. A length and a half by neck. And the first split was 5.61. 5.61. 22.11. 31.28. 31.28. Number three, Flagstaff Flyer, November Fury chat line for Michelle Palmer and Peter Trim, Devon Meadows. Number seven, Stat Deck McFernley and the Rickadeck Syndicate, Elite State Rickadeck. Number nine, Bomber McGee showed some pace for John Downer for the Make Us Million Syndicate. Bombastic Shiraz, Maggie's Alarm and one Captain Bond, fourth for John Carr. 3791, 3791. It's a length and a half by neck, a length and a half by neck, 31 and 28 the time. Not on. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Did not make a mistake with that call. <laughs> well, you didn't hear a mistake anyway. Thank you. All clear, hat. All clear. Hey, can you get me a megaphone to yell it out so they can hear me? <laughs> <laughs> It's all clear on the first, all clear, all clear, Cramman, folks. Sport and relays, it's all clear, all clear, 3791, 3791 on the first, 3791, a length and a half a neck, 3128, race 2, 439, 7 and 9 out 10, fast crumpet. Uh, beyond blue, one of the major ones there. We've got a 21st birthday party out here tonight. You'll probably hear it later on. We can hear it now. So it's going to be a long night. So umpire goes bang, 270. They're all first starters. It's a debutante. The Win TV debutante uh, gave us maiden, and they're all gave us qualified too. And they're being called up. Umpire goes bang, 270. 560 for Pierre Cross Daughter, 570 for Dr. Dotty, 580 Tiger Douglas. Yeah, thank you very much, John. Win TV debutant for the maidens here. Gobus bonus, eight hundred dollars extra, and all greyhounds are Gobus qualified. The umpire goes bang. Well, umpire goes bang is the favourite. Two seventy being boxed here for the debutants. Perkos daughter on the inside had support. Tiger Douglas, ball boy, and call me Rusty. Up in the even numbers, Doctor Dotty, Bronny Bluebell, Sylvan Lil, and the umpire goes bang, and they're about to bounce the ball. The green light goes on here for the third out of sale greyhounds. The favourite in box number eight. Set to come out. 
Away they go. Percos Dorda began well. The umpire goes bang. Missed the start. Going fast the outside. Tiger Douglas showing some pace on the first turn was Ball Boy. Down from the outside. Call me Rusty. The umpire goes bang. Starting to wind up. Dr. Dotty dropped back there. And so did Bronnie Bluebell. It's a race in two at the moment. Percos Dorda just in front. The danger now is Tiger Douglas racing to it very quickly on the turn. Call me Rusty. An umpire goes bang down the outside. But Percos Dorda, she finds a bit. Races away. Good win. Two links to Tiger Douglas. Umpire goes bang. Doing its best work at the finish from Call Me Rusty and Bonnie Brobell. Back behind those runners were Ball Boy, Sylvan Will and Dr Dotty. And the time on the clock, 25.27. Gobers qualified, all greyhounds in the race. 5.32 the first split. 1.387, 1.387, 5.32 was the first split. 13.99 and the run home on the race was 11.28, 1.38 and 7. Appreciated the inside draw. She scores by two. Two links by two. Percos daughter didn't run that fast time to the first turn, but she kept them out. And she kept on finding a bit by solved the puzzle out of golden design for Brian Halpin and uh, David Fasoli over at uh, Hayfield. Over Tiger Douglas, which looked a real change on the turn. Battled on well by uh, Craigley Whistler out of Bo Douglas for Kevin Ward. Uh, number eight, after being slow out, umpire goes bang. Has raced uh, home very strongly. El Grande choice option for Chris Johansson. So 1387's run fourth in the race. Call me Rusty. Two links by two. And uh, the time on the race was 25 and uh, 27. With the winner 560 and 180, $2.110. Quinella 1460 exacta paid $47.40. The other multiples to come. Two links by two. 25 27. Bit of trouble in the race to Dr. Dotty, so you could probably forget about that run. And Sylvan and Lil didn't have much luck. They crunched up on that first turn. Greyhounds coming down from the outside. But as I say, Percos daughter has kept them all out to uh, get the money. The remainder of those uh, multiples, the trifecta paid $70.30. The dub 8 and 1, 27 10. The first four, $325. Duets 1 and 3, 370. 1 and 8, 230. 3 and 8 paid $2.80. The all clear still to come here at Sale for race number three. And all clear at sale. All clear sale. Just to note that uh, between races five and six today, all caution representing Victoria in the National Sprint Championship in Sydney on Saturday week will trial, time trial between races. I don't think he'll be running any sort of time in these conditions, but he gets a... Uh, Hit out before his uh, journey to Wentworth Park, searching for a Group 1 glory in the National Sprint Championship at Wendy Park. Of course, he's New South Wales owned and Victorian trained. Now, last of them going in. A favour to hear a Cisco flame. They're all in. Green lights on. Bunny rolling. Set to go. Ready now. Racing. Cisco Flame came out well wide out, is going to lead far more mist and a go may go, followed by Call Me Rusty not far away. And then Smart Fred over Bridie's colour, drifting back a bit, Bow Street Secret, Gleaming Faith. Off the back, Cisco Flame, a narrow front runner, now kicked away. Two to go, may go. In trouble, far more missed and call me rusty. Up on the rail, Bow Street Secret, Gleaming Faith. Cisco Flame off and gone up the straight, though, from go, may go. And Cisco Flame goes on to score. Running on late, Bow Street Secret, second over, go, may go. Fourth ahead, Bob, a Gleaming Faith or Bridie's colour. Could go either way. Far more missed, uh, next would have been far more missed over Call Me Rusty and Smart Fred the tail end to run 26.12. Seven the winner, Cisco Flame, 8.77 the early split, 18.47, 7.65 and the runners 26.12. And the winner number seven, Cisco Flame, Bob. Pure Octane out of Cisco. Check John Galea at Lara. 877, 1847, 765 and 2612. And seven the winner. Seven, three, two, eight. Seven, three, two, eight. Bow Street Secret second by Phoenix Ablaze out of Sheila's memory. Bill Donlan. Go May Go has run third. By Primo Uno you know, out of Zakuba Bird Ken Cubic. So seven three and a two, seven three two. Seven three two and eight's run fourth. Seven three two eight's fourth in a photo over number five. Seven three two eight. And twenty six twelve the run. All clear.
All clear. Seven, three, two, eight, all clear. Five and a half by a half length. Five and a half by a half for the margins. Five and a half by a half. Twenty six twelve. Well, Grundo out of tide runner. Only had one start on debut. A second at Terralgan over five hundred and thirteen metres to Anne Bin's Empress. So it's hard to pick a winner. Uh, Pete Eustace likes the three. He's put it on top to beat four, one and eight. Let's head to him now. For a worthy cause. Okay, Dave, about to come up here for the third on the card. Big night tomorrow night at Cranbourne. Wish them well. Their 34th birthday meeting at uh, Cranbourne with the birthday cup and also the heats of the, the Puppy Classic, the final there next week or the week after tomorrow. $10,000 to the winner. Good prize money. Now they're about to come up here for the third on the card. It's another very good uh, betting race with the favourite Mini Driver 4.30 now. 4.30, $6 about the Red Angel I Am. And then also for Scrooge Maduck, $6.20 Any Bay. Uh, $8.50 Blackwood Prince here. $7 for uh, Gaelic Fusilier. I found it a very hard race to, to pick. Actually settled for Mini Driver. Being boxed, Angel I Am coming up with Mini Driver. Spanish Jackie and Any Bay. And evens can come up now. And that's Blackwood Prince with Gaelic Fusilier, Scrooge McDuck and Litchfield Park on the outside. So they're just about right here for the third on the card. Quality, of course, races five through eight. Some value there again tonight here at Sale. Set to come out here, and on the inside, Angel A.M. began about okay, but Blackwood Prince was away a whale. Litchford Park missed the start. Spanish Jackie goes to second on the first turn. Litchfield Park racing around the outside from Any Bay. Back behind them then came Scrooge McDuck on its outside. Gaelic Fusilier, a mile back Angel A.M., and so was Mini Driver. Off the back turn, and Blackwood Prince with a lead of a couple. Here's Any Bay right up on the inside to split it with Spanish Jackie and Litchfield Park. But Any Bay's going away. Any Bay scores by three and a half lengths. Spanish Jackie and the Blackwood Prince, and just behind those runners getting home Gaelic Fusier late from Litchfield Park and uh, then came at the head of the others Mini Driver which was never a winning chance in the race and has finished well back ahead of it Angel I Am 7524 the numbers 7524 in 25 and uh, 26 523 the first split 1402 the second run home 1124 2526 remains as the time for the 440 meters 752 and 4 Mate smoking fury. Good crowd here for the East Gippsland Make-A-Wish Foundation and uh, sponsors here and also things that are happening on track to raise uh, to raise much needed funds for a worthy cause. Okay Dave, about to come up here for the third on the card. Big night tomorrow night at Cranbourne. Wish them well. Their 34th birthday meeting at uh, Cranbourne with the birthday cup and also the heats of the, the Puppy Classic, the final there next week or the week after tomorrow. $10,000 to the winner. Good prize money. Now they're about to come up here for the third on the card. It's another very good uh, betting race with the favourite Mini Driver 430 now. 430, $6 about the Red Angel I Am. And then also for Scrooge Maduck, $6.20 Any Bay. Uh, $8.50 Blackwood Prince here. $7 for uh, Gaelic Fusilier. I found it a very hard race to to pick. Actually settled for Mini Driver. Being boxed, Angel I Am coming up with Mini Driver Spanish Jackie and Any Bay, and Evans can come up now. And that's Blackwood Prince with Gaelic Fusilier, Scrooge McDuck, and Litchfield Park on the outside. So they're just about right here for the third on the card. Quality, of course, races five through eight. Some value there again tonight here at Sale. Set to come out here, and on the inside, Angel I Am began about okay, but Blackwood Prince was away a whale. Litchford Park missed the start. Spanish Jackie goes to second on the first turn. Litchfield Park racing around the outside from Any Bay. Back behind them then came Scrooge McDuck on its outside. Gaelic Fusilier, a mile back Angel I Am, and so was Mini Driver. Off the back turn, and Blackwood Prince with a lead of a couple. Here's Any Bay right up on the inside to split it with Spanish Jackie and Litchfield Park. But Any Bay's going away. Any Bay scores by three and a half lengths. Spanish Jackie and a Blackwood Prince, and just behind behind those runners getting home Gaelic Fusier late from Litchfield Park and uh, then came at the head of the others Mini Driver which was never a winning chance in the race and has finished well back ahead of it Angel I Am 7524 the numbers 7524 in 25 and uh, 26 523 the first split 1402 the second run home 1124 2526 remains as the time for the 440 metres 752 and 4 
and Eddie Bay getting up uh, and getting a split on the home turn has run on very, very strongly to win the money going away for Peter Giles. Gives him uh, a winning double. Eddie Bay is by Primo Yuno out of a star of creation, owned by K.A. Delzeal. Second in the race, number five, Spanish Jackie by Jack Jr. out of a Spanish Maxi for the Richer family at uh, Foster. And third placing has gone to Blackwood Prince by a token prince out of Majestic Melody. The uh, margin's about to come up with the all clear, with the winner six thirty and three dollars, two forty and two seventy. Quinella nineteen ninety, exact at thirty nine forty. Other multiples are about to come. Three and three quarters by a half. Three and three quarter lengths. The winning margin by a half length, and twenty five twenty six the time for that maiden. The all clear about to come up. In this. Uh Aged eight dog field as they prepare to move in here. Race number five. Runners filling the boxes. Race five from Ballarat. Going in. Each way onto the field. Nearly every runner in single figures here, Mass. Very, very even affair. Hotline Honey 470 holds the call as the bunny starts its journey here. Ready? Racing, because I can, the inside got out nicely, so did two extremes and trying to get up on their inside now was Go Wild Doc. Also around the outside making ground was Hotline Honey Gee, it's a traffic jam. Anna Vase on the inside, further back to Snake Pliskin, two extremes uh, got shuttered out the back, then Dodgy Tom as they make the turn and because I can now back last, Go Wild Doc from Anna Vay driving at it. Anna Vay after Go Wild Doc and Anna Vay went on to win it from Go Wild Doc. Third is Snake Pliskin. Fourth might be two extremes who's come again if it's got that spot in advance of Because uh, I Can and also uh, Snake Pliskin. Powerful storm towards the tail end with Dodgy Tom. Gee, it was a pretty rough old affair. Four, three, seven, and five. Four, three, seven, and five, Ballarat. Anna Vea, Black Pitch, whelped in May of 06 by Primo Uno from Star of Creation. P. Giles at Moe for K. Del Zeal. Three starts for two wins now. Second's gone to three, Go Wild Doc, a Black Dog, August 06. Go Wild Teddy, Glenn's Melody. Lindsay Moore's head at Bungarook. And third to seven, Snake Pliskin, a Brindle Dog. May 06, Primo Uno, Salamander Lass, Jenny Thorpe at Arthur's Creek. Margins are a length and three quarters by one here at Ballarat. 8.75, 18.26 were the split times. The time was 25 and 72. A length and three quarters by one. Four, three, seven and five. Divvies here, Anna Vay, 6.53.20. Go Wild Doc, $2. Snake Pliskin, third, $4.90. Runners at the boxes, race number six. And preparing to we're going to the boxes here. This is the uh, second leg of the quaddy tonight. And also the first leg of the daily double. All these runners, every single one of them, won a, uh, won a race here at Ballarat last Thursday afternoon at the twilights and that was in a heat of this grade five series and they've come together in this uh, final which is worth twelve hundred and forty five dollars to the winner plus a gobus bonus and all of them are qualified with the exception of you know one and innuendo it's two dollars ninety for number six where's rufus who's going for the hat trick 
He ran the fastest of the heats. He scored a huge win here last week. And Vintage Octane is the second pick at $4.10. 460 for Super Smart Piper. They're moving into line. Race six here at the Greyhounds at Ballarat. Barney, Super sp Smart Piper, Vintage Octane, Pure L, you know wine. Where's Rufus? Out of the out in seven in your window eight, and there's the light. Set to go, Top Cat video final. Ready. And racing, Barney got a reasonable start. He's trying to boot up and use the ready. Willie keeps out uh, innuendo. And also Super Smart Piper is now going for a rails run. Purell's back forth. Followed on the outside by Where's Rufus. And then came You Know Wine. Gee, your vintage octane's a long way back. So is Anna As they round the turn, the front runner now, Super Smart Piper. From Barney, who's trying to come again. And then Where's Rufus? And Barney zipped up on the inside and stole the prize here from Super Smart Piper. I think Where's Rufus? Rufus lasted for third in advance of the fast finishing Anna Vey, uh, then followed by Pure Allen Vintage Octane, who was back with uh, You Know Wine and Innuendo. Well, super smart. Piper had it one everywhere. Uh, not at the end. 866, 18 even, and it's 1, 2, 6, and 7 at Ballarat. 1, 2, 6, and 7. Barney jumped well. Then got railed by a super smart Piper and then railed it and then uh, chased that Greyhound and railed it again and won by three quarters on the post with four and a quarter second and third. 25 41 was the run after splits of 866 and 18 dead, three quarters by four and a half. And Barney, who's a white and black dog, whelped an October 06 by Elite State from Footy Bob. It's raced by D. Allison, trained by M. Fernley at Yanar. Gets home to win from two super smart Piper, a brindle dog, August 06, Primo, you know, missed the boat. See Kelly at Warnable and six, where's Rufus, a red and fawn dog, October 06, where's Pedro, Din's portrait, H. Manolitsis at Listerfield South and here are the dividends. Barney number one, 940 the win, 210 the place. Defeat super smart Piper, $2. Where's Rufus, third, forty. Quinella, 1280, exact a $69. Trifecta, $151.90. Running double three into one paid forty five ninety, and the duets one and two four thirty one and six six dollars two and six two dollars forty, and the first four for one two six and seven returns one thousand four hundred and sixty three dollars and ten cents. Your clear signal. We should have any moment one two six seven. The numbers after the Top Cat video final and the all clear is up now. All clear, Michael, and uh, welcome aboard. One two six seven. All clear. At Bellarat. Glass coming up here. Graham's about to start now. 220 now, Matty R. Moving in. Rollo Dogs are getting set here. Moving in. Uh, 220, Matty R. And uh, 320 for Ain number 8. 720, Beachy Line. 640, Graphic Delight. Coming in well. Fast to 10. Green light. All in. Set for a start. Ready? Racing Matty R a little bit slow on the inside away. Faster Gary Tiger to go through early. There was Starley's Dame. Wider on the track there came Graphic Delight and they were followed further back then by Ain Bay. Over on the inside there was Beach Line. Uh, dropping out of it there would have been uh, County Surprise and also Visible Secret as they travel up to the turn now. And Stagari Tiger the leader. Starley's Dame right out the centre followed by Graphic Delight. And on the outside then came Ain Bay but near the post it's Stagari Tiger. Stagari Tiger over at Graphic Delight and Ain Bay. Followed further back then by Beach Line. Starley's Dame Weakening at the end, followed further back by County Surprise, and one of the last there would have been Visible Secret. And uh, I think we lost one on the run here, and we did, but it's obscured in the bay. There it is, the red, it's the red Matty R, which has gone gone a miss in the run. Geez, had a shocking run tonight. Uh, Rocky and uh, Dominic Crisafi stand by for numbers here 25 58 the time, 25 58. Last on the card, two Stigari target, 32, 20 and 5.30. They should pay here. Numbers in the last. We'll have it in a moment. 25.58 is the run. 25.58 is the time. 25.58 here as we stand by for numbers. It'll be two Stigari target over the line. It looks like two, seven, eight and three, but we stand by for the... Uh, Confirmation of numbers there. Three lengths by two of the margins, three by two. OK, stand by for more. We don't have any details at this stage of the last. So on the note from Shepparton, we'll sign off and say goodnight to you all. Let's go to Andrew Patterson, race one, Cranbourne.
25.58 at the time. 25.58. It's 2783 in the last, 2783. 2783 and all clear. All clear, 2783. Three lengths by two. Three by two, all clear. 2558 at the time. 2783 and all clear. 2783. Martins, three by two, 2558. Three by two, 2558. 2783 and all clear. All clear there. <coughs> Mm -hmm. That's it. Thirty-two twenty and five thirty. The winner one eighty one seventy. Win and place all clear. All clear is there. Okay, uh, thank you, John. Yes, Brother Nooms, the favourite here for Tony Cortese coming up, leading them up in the red box at 240, but very good money for Hello Rodney at 350, and at odds for out of there, although it has got out to 870. Race to follow will be uh, the first of the five heats of the Chris Humphrey Office National Group 2 to Rogan Cup. First and second place getters become the finalists here next Friday night. Two slowest thirds will be the reserves. Box draw on track after race nine. Set now. Way they go. Brother Nooms a bit